identity is kind of weird, isn't it? You know, you start to think about it, and there's no way to put a definition behind who you are. So many different things that go into telling who you are that you can't put it behind a single word or a couple sentences. So today, uh, I want to talk about identity and the three important things that make up who you are as a person. The concepts that have the highest impact on any person's identity are character, memories, and appearance. Appearance is a major player in social identity. When you describe a family member or a friend to someone, you might use descriptors like brown hair or blue eyes. People wear different types of clothing depending on who they are. I'm wearing this blue hat and this shirt with my favorite band on it. But is that what really defines who we are? If you took my clothes away and my body away from me, then what would be left? And that's where memories come into play. Memories are ways that people can go back in time. They play a role in personal and social identity. I'm sure there are memories that you share with everyone and also ones that you keep to yourself and never tell a soul. A good quote from Hank Green says, We go to sleep every day, but when we wake up, our conscious selves remember who we were the day before. Memories are some of the most influential and emotional creations of the human brain. Without them, many people would say that the person has lost their identity. That might not be true, though, because of the last key factor called character. Character is arguably the most important part of identity. The best way I can explain it is it's what you do when no one else is around. It's how you react to everyday situations, like finding a spider on the wall, or finding a coin in your cell phone. A quote from the School of Life explains this, saying, If my sense of what is funny, wise, interesting, or important remains the same, I can still, in some fundamental way, claim to be the same person. People can be reminded of their past, but they can't be reminded of how to respond to situations. Even if someone's memories and appearance are lost, their identity will still stay intact with their character. Appearance allows you to identify someone through their physical characteristics. You can share memories to people about your past, and character is who you are every day as a person. My name is Callum Stringer. This is my appearance. Uh, one of my favorite memories is traveling to the United Kingdom with my dad, and my character is helping worms when they're on the side of the road.